Okay, how's it going YouTube? This is Mr. Fox 101. Today I'm going to show you how to run applications in your background. Okay. Um, got any application you want. <coughs> All you gotta do is either go to Nasidia or Icy. Um, as you can see my my iPod. I mean this is my this is my iPod. It's got a little swallow thing next to it. That means it's running in the background. <laughs> okay, so all you gotta do is download two things. I mean, some people say you have to download three, but I only download two. And yeah, it's pretty basic and simple. Either open City or I see. I'm just gonna show you City because. Most people don't know what ICE, a lot of people don't know what ICE is. And you're going to search in the search bar. I don't want to do that. Oh, packages. You're going to search Backgrounder. Backgrounder. Okay, wait for it to reload the data. <coughs> And by the way, this will probably be one of my last videos for two weeks because I'm going out of town. Um, and then you're going to download... Um, which a lot of people already do have it downloaded. SB settings. And if you don't have it though, uh, just go ahead and download it, I guess. Okay, so when you have both of those things downloaded, your icon will look... If you have a glass card theme, it'll look like that. It'll say Backgrounder on it. Click on it. And it just shows you how to use release notes, no issues, global, and application specific. This is the blacklisted, which is the ones you don't want to get blocked. And see those are. Or you can do always enabled. It's the ones you always want to enable, but you can't enable from here. I don't know why they do that. So let's say I want to enable Facebook or something. Okay. Actually, you know, I already have that enabled. Um, I want to do. I don't know. A good one maybe to do would be. We're just gonna do Facebook anyway. Okay. All you gotta do is hold down the home button for like two seconds. And it'll say backgrounding enabled. Continue holding to force quit. Just keep on holding it. And then you just let go. And now you officially have it in the background. So Facebook is now used in the background. And then when you go on it. And you keep on holding it. It'll say continue holding to force quit. Okay, that's how you run applications in the background. See, my iPod's running in the background. And it, Facebook will eventually do some stuff. Alright, so this is Mr. iPod Touch 101 here. And please give a good rate, give a good comment, and subscribe.